It was more than 70 years ago when a teenage Ruth Bader Ginsburg roamed the halls of James Madison High School on Bedford Avenue. Precocious and determined, Ginsburg would ultimately make her school proud. So help me God. Today, a growing makeshift memorial in her honor takes up real estate outside her alma mater. Her fight for equality and the impact she made not lost on current juniors, Eleni Dadian and Deniza Dazabekova. Whether it's Roe v. Wade, whether, you know, um, whether it's about the Voting Rights Act, I just, it's, it's insane how much she's done. Just the fact that with her passing, a lot of people are afraid of losing their basic human rights is just, just, just angers me a lot. Amid all her success, Ginsburg never forgot where she came from, becoming a proud lifetime member of the James Madison High School Alumni Association, regularly meeting with students, part of the Law Institute program. This meetup happening in 2016. The school even named their on-site mock courtroom after after the justice, Jane Carbonaro Arborito, an alumni herself and current real estate attorney, credits Ginsburg for opening doors that have made a lasting impact on her own career. The Ruth Bader Ginsburgs of the world that came before me paved the path so well that by the time I was applying for law school, I didn't even feel different. Obstacles like the death of her mother before her high school graduation she took head on, never taking her eye off the ball. Many of the teachers hope Ginsburg's story of perseverance inspires generations to come. If a humble uh, girl from Brooklyn was able to achieve such great things, why can't they? Hopefully they will learn from her to really stay focused, stay ambitious, stay dedicated, and to truly have compassion and empathy for others.